Hey everybody, I'm back. Yeah, I got a plastic shower cap on my head. I'm deep conditioning. Um, I just took off my um, my Ufart wig. I um, just showed you guys the closure that I received today, so I'm going to try and have my sister braid my hair. And I'm probably going to leave like a little tiny bit of hair out on the front to cover the lace. But um, other than that, all the rest of my hair, I believe I'll be having um, braided up under my wig my you part wig um and i'm really trying really hard not to have to reconstruct my wig so i may like cut like two tracks worth of um worth of the net off of my wig and just um put it on to my my head around the the closure but that's not what the video is about i was just explaining why i have on the shower cap on my head um this is going to be another China Glaze video. I got a new color yesterday and I did. I already put it on my fingernails and it looks so nice. Look. It's like an orange color and it is called Peachy King. They come with the most cutest names. I don't know if you can see it. Oh, you can't see it. Peachy King. And it was the same price as always. Um, I just popped into Ulta real quick and got um, this nail color and went home after work. And I like it. It's like bright. And it's a color that I wouldn't usually wear. But I don't know if they'll let me wear this to work. But I am off today and tomorrow as far as I know. But let's see. Because lately they haven't been bothering me about my nail colors. And the last color I had was like a kind of bluish, um, bluish green color. And they didn't bother me about it. So let's see. But so far, I like it, and it's really pretty. So th what I did this time was I used the sponge nail polish remover, um, and I went ahead and put my conditioning nail stuff on each um, nail. Then I put a top coat of the clear base coat from China Glaze. Then I put, this time I only put one coat of um, China Glaze for the peachy Keen, um, rather than my usual two, which I probably should have because some spots are really thin. So maybe tonight after I finish my hair, I might go over, over it with another layer. But as of now, I have one layer of the conditioner, one layer of the top coat. I have one layer of the China Glaze, and then I have another layer on top of the China Glaze Peachy Keen with the, the um, clear coat. And it didn't take too long to do because... When I removed my nail polish, it didn't take so long because I used the sponge. Um, I guess that's all I have to say. But I love, love China Glaze. And as y'all can see, I love it. Um, I think I may actually start getting other, like, other ones like OPI and, or, what it's called? Something. It starts with the O. Um... I think I'll go with OPI, and then um, it's something else that starts with the O, but I think I'll try those if I like their colors and stuff, because I want, like, real subtle. I'm looking for, like, a gray, like, a grayish color um, for um, one of those, because I don't think China Glaze has it. If they do, I haven't seen it at Ulta, um, but I think that's the next color I'll get, um, but as now I'm wearing the Peachy King, and it's really pretty. But bye, you guys. I think if I finish my hair tonight, I'll come back with a video showing um, showing me wearing the U-part wig with the closure. If I don't finish it tonight, I will come to you guys tomorrow and show you. But this time when I took out my hair, even though I didn't wear it as long as, um, like, I think the last time I wore my hair, my U-part wig, I left it in for like three weeks straight, almost a month. But this time I think it was like two weeks, one or two weeks. And I didn't get as much shedding or breakage as last time. Because last time I had a huge, huge ball of hair come out of my hair. like, And I was so upset. But this time it was like that big. But last time it was like this much hair that was wrapped up in a ball. And I was so upset. Um, but last time I believe, I believe before I did my, got my hair braided, I, um, I did all the normal stuff. I deep conditioned and everything. And what else? And after I finished the washing process, um, I went ahead and 
oiled my scalp real good because this time when I took my hair out it was still like oiled um but I didn't get as much breakage as last time um but hopefully with this um closure I won't have to put so much heat on my leave out because I don't plan on taking it off if it looks good I plan on leaving that right on like I'm not gonna be the one like oh let me take the closure off just because and flatten my leave out no because like I said in the last video my leave out like this side is normal this side is really short and that's why it's so hard for me to cover the tracks so hopefully I can grow it back I'm gonna like be oiling my um scalp and stuff real good um I'm thinking of actually getting using my um, Queen's Hair products with the closure and getting that installed in the shop. Because I did recently find out that there has been a shop um, put right next to my old hair store, right, like, five minutes away from my house. And, like, they prices, like, for a full sew-in, like, with the closure and everything, is 100 something I don't like that, but if it lasts for a good time and I can actually get to my hair... I think that would be good, but I'll see if I'll do it. But as of now, I'm doing my own hair except for when my sister braids my hair underneath. But yeah, um, that's all I have to say for right now. So, bye you guys.